This is InfoLife TV headline news, February 2nd. I'm Margot Dutkevich. Egypt has decided to close its breach border with Gaza on Sunday and Hamas will not stand in the way, senior Hamas official Mahmoud Zahal said Saturday after holding talks with Egyptian officials. Egypt has agreed to coordinate with Hamas on some border issues and enable thousands of Palestinians stuck in Egypt to head to third countries if they have visas or permits. Egyptian security forces are searching for four Palestinians who slipped into the country from the Gaza Strip and are suspected of planning suicide attacks in resorts in the Sinai Peninsula. Egyptian security officials announced the recent arrest of 12 Hamas operatives armed with weapons and explosives who are planning to attack Israelis in the Sinai. Mauritanian authorities have apprehended three suspects believed to be connected to the shooting on the Israeli embassy in the capital of Nokshot early Friday morning. Gunmen opened fire at the embassy, wounding three French citizens, officials said. The suspects were nabbed while attempting to evade a police checkpoint. French President Nicolas Sarkozy married his girlfriend, former model Carla Bruni, on Saturday at the Elysee Palace. The mayor who performed the ceremony said... Sarkozy, 53, and Brunei, 40, were married in the presence of close family and friends at the palace. Israeli tennis player Shah Haper rallied to beat Dinara Safina Saturday, giving Israel a 1-0 lead over defending champion Russia in the first round of the Fed Cup. Peir, who ranks number 17, won four straight games to clinch the match. Infolive.tv, live on your mobile phone. Do you want to keep ahead of the news and receive updates on what is happening in Israel? Infolive.tv offers you a unique service, regular video news updates, free of charge, on your cell phone. To sign up, enter our website at www.infolive.tv and click on the mobile services banner. Today the whole world talks about Israel. But who broadcasts from Israel to the world in four languages? Live from Jerusalem, InfoLive TV, the first international Israeli television channel that operates 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Follow current events in Israel and the Middle East. Video features, interviews, news programs and news briefs live as history unfolds. If you want a direct link to Israel, access InfoLive.tv.